by the mayor of Meigs County, Bill James. Mayor, good morning. Good morning, Steve. How are you doing? <clears throat> Sir, I'm doing good, and our uh, our prayers are with you this morning. Tell me... Uh, Tell me uh, about your county this morning, sir. Well, you know, we're still in a, a state of shock because of this. Uh, I've I worked at the, taught at the high school for 33 years, and we've never had, in, in those 33 years, had an, any type of like this or any incident of involving a school bus and, and kids. And uh, this is really a, a real shock to us. Well, I, uh, uh, sir, I am, uh, we are all heartbroken uh, for our friends in uh, in Meigs County. What are you, uh, uh, we're joined by uh, Meigs County Mayor Bill James. Uh, Mayor, what are you hearing from law enforcement uh, or at last report? Well, the same thing that you just said, uh, that the bus driver was killed and her daughter was sitting by, behind her and she has broken legs and uh, was trapped in the wreck and was trying to find out about the condition of her mother uh, at, at, on the scene of the accident. So, you know, this is really a, a terrible thing for our county, and uh, we hearts go out for the parents involved in this and, and all their uh, relatives, and, you know, this is, it, it really hits at the heart of our county when it's, we're such a small uh, community, and, and we're very uh, close knit. So, you know, we're, we're really, we're really, really, really heartbroken about this. We are uh, joined by Meigs County Mayor Bill James here on Mix One Hundred Four One. And Mayor, uh, it was an amazing uh, response. Uh, I, I know uh, Bradley County, uh, uh, Saint Cruz, uh, Hamilton County. It was uh, uh, quite a response yesterday. That's that's exactly right. You know, we have a system where different counties will respond to emergencies like this. And, uh, you know, I can't say enough about how quickly all the different counties responded to help in our uh, problem with the, with the bus wreck. And, uh, you know, they, they really, really respond very quickly and, and help so much. Uh, you know, we're we're very thankful that we have a uh, system where different counties can help when there is a tragedy such as this. Joined by Meigs County Mayor Bill James, uh, live on the phone this morning uh, from Meigs County. Uh, Mayor, um, talk about your, your Meigs County uh, school system. Obviously, this strikes at the heart of the uh, school system in Meigs County. It, it certainly does, you know. Uh, uh, it again, we're you know we uh, are a small community, and uh, it really does strike at the heart of us. The uh, principal at Mig South, where the kids were leaving from the bus uh, around home, uh, she's a former student of mine, and she uh, was a very great student, and she played for the. Uh, University of uh, Georgia in basketball, and and so you know played on the ch state championship team. So you know, it, 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 like I said, we're we're all kind of very closely knit group, and 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 we're all just suffering so much. I don't know, you know, the only thing we know we can do is our prayers and uh, and go out for the parents of, involved in this and. Uh, we'll just have to just wait and see what else we can do to help these people. Mayor uh, James, I believe you're uh, referring uh, to uh, Rachel Moore. I believe that's right. The uh, the player is now the principal. Is that right? That's correct. That's she, correct. Rachel you know, Moore. she was our uh, uh, here at Cleveland in Cleveland at Cleveland High. You know, she was uh, the women's coach for years and uh, went to a state tournament. So uh, she's well thought of around here, Mayor. Well, she's a super, super young lady. We we thank the world of her too. Yeah, and and she's doing a great job at our school system. And you know, our our superintendent of schools, Clinton Baker. You know, he he's a super young man too. And uh, I've known him for years. And we uh, talked together and coached together. And uh, I'm I'm just uh, 
you know, we, we'll 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 get through this, but we'll have to have the parents and the relatives involved in this. And again, uh, you know, uh, in my 50 years living in Mix County, we've never had any bus school bus uh, problems before like this, and it's mm. it really is a, a tragic. We're joined by uh, Meigs County Mayor Bill James. Final uh, comment, uh, Mayor. You had, I don't know if you've heard this, uh, you probably have the reaction from Blood Assurance uh, to this uh, to this uh, tragedy. I was told, Mayor, here in Cleveland, down at the Village Green Town Center, where Blood Assurance is here and then at other offices, there were lines, Mayor, around, I mean, they stayed open until 10 o'clock, and then I, I was given a report that they stayed open here in Cleveland until about midnight because of the crowds. And uh, we are actually going to be joined by the president of Blood Assurance at about 8 o'clock this morning, J.B. Gaskins. That has to make you feel good. It certainly does. And, you know, we do appreciate such great involvement of of the people of Cleveland. And, uh, you know, again, you know, we're we're all in this together and, and, People of Cleveland have been very uh, supportive of Mix County, and we, we certainly do appreciate it. Well, Mayor, anything you need, our stations are here for you, sir, and uh, you've got my cell phone, so you call me anytime, okay? Okay, Steve. Thank you very much. God bless you, Mayor, and we're praying uh, for you and your county. Thank you, sir. Mm, thank you.